Hello dear students, I am very happy to announce that now DPMA is going to release Pathology Rapid Revision 1.0 on 1st of the July 2022, right? So this DPMA Pathology Rapid Revision 1.0 which is going to be launched on 1st July 2022, this will have salient features which will be uh, covering uh, uh, all the important topics which had been asked in la last 5 to 7 years which is concise, conceptual and illustrative and this will be spanning for 15 hours. So remember I have covered the all 18 chapters of the Robbins in a simple 15 hours of the lecture and this is in a MCQ format but remember it is not like a MCQ question answer and it is like that. It is in explanation and conceptual explanation is given to all the important topics and it has covered all the latest topic which has been asked in 5 to 7 years of the exam. right? So it is containing apart from that it is containing all the important updates which is given in the Robbins 10th edition which is a very very important and crucial for your upcoming INI CT exam. Not only the Robbins update, it contains Harrison 20th edition, Davitas, Windrobe and other textbook uh, updates also which will be useful for you within that 15 hours of the span and you will see that it is very concise, it is very crisp and it is having so much high yielding points in those discussion which will be giving you boost to your preparation and you will be quickly able to revise within 15 hours of this uh, lecture. And in this lecture you will find I have I have explained this chapter wise I have covered the important topics and I have I have covered all the high yielding topics from those chapters in a conceptual manner where you will understand the concept also along with how to solve that question with that trick also right and it is suitable for everyone who are preparing for NEET PG exam who are preparing for INISET exam or even for FMG exam and you can see that. Uh, in this rapid revision, as I said, the 15 hours of the lecture, I have included the all chapter C, cell adaptation, inflammation, genetics, immunology, neoplasia, bleeding, anemia, leukemia, cardiovascular system, lung pathology, kidney, central nervous system, GIT, liver, breast pathology, genital urinary tract and endocrinology, musculoskeletal system and skin. So all these topics have been included just in within 15 hours and those who are using my DPMA full length lecture which is of 100 hours for them also it will be a very good for rapid revision. So that is why I wanted to say that do not miss this. This is going to help you a lot in all the exams NEET PG, INICT or FMG whatever is going to come in front of you. Why I am saying because from past 12-13 years I am teaching and I have seen consistently my lecture there are so many questions are coming and it is not so many it's not only 20 or 25 it is more than 40 question I used to see that earlier when need PG used to conduct but now need PG the quantity has reduced to 200 question but still I am seeing 36 direct question came in the May 2022 from my DPMA lecture app right so if you will why I am saying that uh, 36 questions are coming you usually you know that key pathology they are asking only 25 question because these questions are uh, these topics are discussed in such a clinical manner that it is going to connect with other subjects also like a medicine surgery ops gynae orthopedics so you will find that many of the questions you can solve from the surgery like a teratoma or seminoma you can solve from uh, reading this uh, book or this uh, app app itself right so that's what i wanted to say that in this inict exam which has happened on may 2022 there were 33 mcqs which came from my lecture app and that is again i will say that it is connecting to other subjects also so because it it is building your concept it is not factual it is a conceptual and this build your concept and that's why i will i will request all the student you must go through this don't miss this opportunity because not only for the exam when you will become clinician or when you will be doing md because i used to hear all these from my student though are those who are doing post graduation they used to say that sir is still those things which you have taught is useful for us so that's why i'm saying that is why this number of mcqs are coming from those notes or my app lecture app and in fmg exam also which has happened just now they have uh, asked 32 direct MCQs. I'm not talking about indirect MCQs. If I will include indirect, it will be going beyond 50. So that's why I wanted to say that. Please go through this. Definitely it is going to be helpful for you. And this rapid revision is going to be a very helpful boon those who have taken my regular lecture also. Right? And for further detail, you can log into our uh, website and you can see or you can contact at this uh, number where you can WhatsApp also. You can call as also at this number 
बट रिमेंबर द टाइमिंग शुड बी फ्रॉम मंडे टू सैटरडे एंड बिटवीन टेन ए एम टू सिक्स पी एम राइट एंड दीज आर माई सोशल मीडियाज क्यू आर कोड यूट्यूब यू कैन कनेक्ट विद माई यूट्यूब ऑल्सो वेयर आई विल बी गिविंग यू सो मेनी इम्पॉर्टेंट टॉपिक्स मेनी ओरिएंटेशन मोटिवेशन एग्जाम ओरिएंटेड ओरिएंटेशन हाउ टू प्रिपेयर फॉर एग्जाम टेलीग्राम चैनल फॉर रेगुलर अपडेट्स क्वेश्चन एंड अदर थिंग्स एंड इंस्टाग्राम ऑल्सो यू कैन सी माई हाई एल्डिंग शॉर्ट्स एंड लेक्चर्स वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू पोस्ट रेगुलरली देयर सो यू कैन यू कैन सी ओवर देयर ऑल्सो यू कैन फॉलो मी एट माई इंस्टाग्राम ऑल्सो दीज आर द वेरियस लिंक्स विच आई विल बी शेयरिंग इन माई सोशल मीडियाज ऑल्सो एंड बिलो दिस link also below this video link also so keep preparing utilize this opportunity of this rapid revision 15 hours i uh, once again i repeat 15 hours all the high yielding topics from 5 to 7 years if you read and revise those topics definitely you are going to have a edge over other student in your exam and my best wishes to all of you for great and grand success in every exams of your life bye bye